I think you'll find out when you're older, like, you don't really need the mansion. Mm, no. <laughs> not had her babies and a bug just flew in my eye so it looks like I'm crying but I'm not crying I'm not sad that Penny hasn't had her babies I'm a little bit sad but I'm not really worried because really it's not that she's been pregnant a long time it's more that we were way off on the due date uh, we know that she should have them ideally before March 3rd that is this Saturday so fingers crossed <laughs> Otherwise, I might be calling the ultrasound tech back out to do some more ultrasounds. As long as Penny is happy and acting normal, I'm not gonna worry. If she acted like she was in labor, I'd be calling the vet, but she isn't. She's acting like, please leave me alone. I hate everybody in the world. Normal Penny personality. So we're gonna trust that she knows what she's doing. She's a great mama, she has easy deliveries. I think she'll be okay. And I'm hoping that at the end of this week, we will have an awesome goat birthing video for you guys. Dora, come here. Come here, give me your frisbee. Dora. Ethan can't play right now, I'll play with you. She doesn't want me to play with her. She wants you to play with her. <laughs> she wants you to have it, but also doesn't want you to have it. Got it. Ethan, why don't you tell everybody what happened to you? Uh, I hurt my back lifting a goat. <laughs> lifting which goat? Tilly. Tilly. So she's fat now. She's, she's fat. Heavy. She's too heavy. It's kind of my fault. I had him lift Tilly and he hurt his back. Kind of strained a muscle. And then he went and he rode for a few hours, which he shouldn't have done because that kind of exacerbated it. Yeah. So... We have another goal this week besides get Penny to have her babies is get Ethan's back healthy enough in time for his race on Saturday. Yeah. His rowing race. So mm -hmm. we're doing magnesium, oils, we're doing um we're doing ibuprofen, we did chiropractor, um, everything to get him feeling better. So all right, Lydia wants to check on Penny, but she says I'm not allowed to come out and grab her. Or sh let her see me because she's oh she got her <laughs> you're right she doesn't like me <laughs> all right she's got her we lock her she's like, oh, no. she sees me <laughs> I'm sorry I'm sorry okay you got her okay really quick oh she feels pretty similar sweetie we're all the same. Sorry. Ah! <laughs> I don't notice like you not know, drastic change that you feel when they're about to deliver. You know, you feel that really, really thin ligament, and it just. <sighs> I don't know. Goats are having fun eating this tree branch. Yeah, I know. It fell down in my garden. It's like Christmas when a tree branch falls down. Isn't it, Luna? Yep. Mom, is this tree evergreen? No. That one loses its leaves. It was it, like this. It, it just comes back really quickly. Yeah. Wow. It's one of the first ones to come back. Yeah, that tree's budding too. Damn. Yep. guys welcome to your daily installment of what is Danelle making for dinner well tonight it is going to be teriyaki chicken with uh, some kind of uh, potato like a mashed potato or a or a broiled baked something potato um veggies from the garden as always and then I'm thinking I might be bold and try a lemon pie so I know I can make a lemon custard question is Will it hold up in the pie? We'll see.
here and then we'll cool it in the fridge and then I'm gonna attempt to make a meringue topping with those egg whites. We tried meringue before. <laughs> It didn't really go very well. I thought it went pretty well. Remember, we made them and they didn't. Oh, you mean those meringue cookies? Yeah. Yeah, but it's easy to do it on a pie. Is this I think. Curd or what is pudding? It? Yeah, is it it's a uh, it's lemon lemon curd. There's some more in here if you want to have some. <laughs> go for it. Grab a is spoon. Is it hot? Um, it's not too hot. You could use your finger <laughs> like a savage, or you could get a spoon like a normal person. <laughs> Not. <laughs> Do it. Ready? Yep. Is it good? It's really good. Is it rich? Mm hmm. Yes. That's <laughs> so good, huh? I love it. So we're going to do the chores early tonight because Lydia has a softball practice and I don't have Ethan home to help me. So, are you shaking that milk pail at me? All the goats, everybody's coming, except Penny. So we're gonna try to get these goats milked and then we can go inside and eat our yummy dinner. Exciting stuff, it's the simple things. Doris! Sorry, I left the gate open. Okay, sorry, sorry, sorry. You know, initially when we started to milk goats, we did it because there it was cheaper for us to do that. So it was cool, because we could go right into our backyard, milk some goats, provide ourselves with really inexpensive, good quality milk. But now, even if we could afford milk, even if we could, <laughs> even if we can afford milk and we don't have to necessarily scrimp and save like we used to, I don't think we'll ever stop having goats or providing our own food because it's just like enjoyable. When I was little, we used to dream about what we would do if we could win the lottery. I don't know why we were thinking about the lottery when we were little, but still, we used to think of all the places we would live and all the cool toys and things we would have. And as I've gotten older, I just uh, I just want to have a happy life and I just want to enjoy um, almost like the ordinary life. Are you all done? Is that your all done look? All right, they say you're naughty in here. Are you gonna go out like you're supposed to? No. Uh oh, here comes Mabel. Nope, 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 you stay there. Scoot back, scoot back. Push her out. No. All right, where's Luna? There you are again. She waits for us to pull her in. You can do it. There she comes. Well, I'll jump, I'll jump, I'll jump. Don't let her go past. Okay, lock her up. <laughs> Lydia, if you could win the lottery, what would you buy? Where would you live? A mansion. A mansion? I would build a mansion. Would you have goats and milk goats? No. <laughs> You're supposed to say, I'd just live here, give the money to charity. Mm, no. <laughs> you wouldn't milk Luna? Who'd milk her I'd one tea? I'd have all our goats as like pets. Yeah, that's a good way to do it. I think you'll find out when you're older, like you don't really need the mansion. Hmm. Yeah, totally. <laughs> and that you definitely need goats. Smells really good. All right, I'll give you guys a little bit, even though you don't deserve it. 
since you attacked me. It's really hard to try to go to the garden when you've got goats because they will follow you and then tackle you. And I didn't get it on camera because I had too many things in my hands, but it happened, you guys. All right, guys, that is it for today. Um, we have dinner ready and we have this awesome pie that I hope has turned out. It looks good so far, so. We'll see if it uh, ends up being as good as it looks. Looks is what's most important. Yeah, that is true. Yes. All right, guys, hope you have a great day. We'll see you later. Bye.